Boy, it was a beautiful day out on the bay today. Here's a view of Alcatraz. Lots of boats out there for Fleet Week and watching the air show. Uh, we had the clouds this morning, but things cleared out for the most part. We did have some fog that made it through the Golden Gate. And that fog is still hugging the coast right now. Here's a live view of San Francisco. None of the low clouds in the city, but it's out there at the coast. And winds, at least right now, are still onshore. We have winds here on top of Mount Tam, about 15 to 20 miles per hour coming in off the ocean. But the winds are forecast to shift as we go into the overnight hours after midnight. The winds instead of coming in off the ocean will be coming in out of the north. Keeps the sea breeze to a minimum. The uh, very dry air starts to come into the Bay Area, so fire danger increasing and temperatures increasing too. We'll see the sunshine for the morning. No fog morning or in the afternoon. Look for 80s by the Bay, 90s into the warmest inland valleys, and a red flag warning in effect for high fire danger. This is in effect for all the higher elevations of the Bay Area as as well as Solano County. Again, very low humidity and conditions will be favorable for tomorrow, tonight, tomorrow, and into Monday for the development of rapid fire growth should a fire start. Here's a look at the satellite view. We had a weather system. There it goes. It went through the Pacific Northwest. Now behind this system, the winds will start pushing from north to south, and that's what brings in the dry air and keeps the fog away. Then we have this storm out here in the Pacific. This is going to approach for Tuesday and bring in the chance for some light rain coming up Tuesday night and into early Wednesday morning. Right now, Rainfall amounts look to be less than a tenth of an inch, perhaps as much as a quarter for the North Bay, though. And then there's a stronger system arriving late Friday. In the meantime, though, we're talking about sunshine and some really toasty temperatures, upper 80s and low 90s for the South Bay. Santa Clara, Sunnyvale, close to 90 degrees. Look for 87 Redwood City and Palo Alto, mid 90s, popping up for the inland valleys. Walnut Creek, Concord, Fairfield going up to 94 degrees. Look for 90s into Vallejo, 80s by the bay. So the sea breeze is going to try to push in in the afternoon, but it's going to be very weak. And that's why San Francisco is warming up about 10 degrees to the low 80s. 90s North Bay and a great day at the beaches with sunshine and 70s. Here's a look ahead as we go through the week. Things change pretty rapidly. Still offshore winds for the early part of Monday. That'll keep things sunny and warm, but it turns cooler. We Cloud things up Tuesday afternoon. We'll have the chance for some rain, light rain Tuesday night. Leftover showers Wednesday morning, a break Thursday. Then a stronger storm comes late Friday into Saturday. We could see possibly as much as a half inch of rain from that. Vicki?